Dr. Freeman, you know, it's really an honor uh, to have an opportunity to interview you here at OR, Meet the Professional Day, and uh, I want to thank um, Herman uh, over there and the, and the uh, alumni, OR alumni, and, as well as Youth Guidance. But the question that I want to ask you, uh, from where you are, from your profession, what you're, what you're doing is pretty lofty, but how can a young person who sees this interview and who's going to see your credentials here at OR, uh, who may be thinking about trying to do what, what, where you are now, what would you say to them to begin that process? I mean, something really simple, but okay. profound. Simple but profound. My name is Freeman Farrow. I am a physician and a lawyer. Uh, and uh, to answer the question, the first thing I would say to them, simple but profound, is why not? Yeah, I, I hear you. I, Why not? Yeah. The, I was talking to some young ladies who came to this um, talk today, and um, when I talked to them about going to law school and how many years of college and how many years of law school, and when I talked to them about going to medical school and how many years of college and medical school and then residency to become a practicing physician, uh, each of them, from their perspective and their age of around between 15 and 18, yes. all their eyes widened. And then I sat down with them and I said, well, wait a minute. If you add the years from when you graduated 18 years old, assuming you graduated 18, okay? Well, for the, for the lawyering, it was another seven years, so that's 25 years old. And for the doctor, it was another uh, 12 years. Sorry, you spend more time. So that was, I'm sorry, that was, that was another, yeah, another 12 years, 11 or 12 years minimum. Um, so that was is what 30 years old or so right and then I asked them what I think is the more important question is as black women in America and you can do it the same for black men although the, 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 the age you get is a little younger um, I asked them what their life expectancy expectancy is if they don't work in a factory and their life expectancy is about 90 years old so I said okay now you're 25 years old or you're 30 years old and you expect to live to 90 so would you like to spend 60 to 65 years working in a factory or being a doctor? Would you like to spend 60 to 65 years working in a factory or being a lawyer? And there you have it. And we can talk about money and how much it costs and loans and all of that. But you know what? You, you prepare in high school to go to college. You prepare in college to go to law school or med school or any other professional school. And you worry about the money after you apply and get in. You will have loans. You will have debt. It happens. Okay? Unless you are Rockefeller. I think some of the kids still know what Rockefeller is. Okay. Who the Rockefellers are. Unless you're a Rockefeller, you will be in debt. But guess what? You will pay it off. Just about everybody I can see here went to some form of school and got in some kind of debt. Not everybody, but most of us who are doing professional jobs. And they're all different jobs in this room. All different professions. Okay? Not, I just happen to be one who keeps collecting them. Sorry. Okay? But all of them have paid off their loan and they're in their own homes. They, some of them have their own businesses. I happen to work for a university. I teach health law now. So now, finally, my medicine and my law are together. But you can do it. And that's the... That's that's the message. The message That's is you can message. do it. And my challenge to them, I don't want to hear it. I said, why not? Did somebody tie you up? Did somebody lobotomize you? You can look it up. Okay? You don't know that word already. Okay? Unless they did that, I don't want to hear it. I want you to take my card and call me, and I want to hear where you are and what you're doing and what stage you're in, because you can do it. You will need help along the way. You will need support. None of us got here alone. I didn't. But you can do it. And guess what? If those other people can do it, whoever you think are those other people, then so can you. 